What's going on YouTube? Jeans here. Hope you guys are having an amazing day today. We are back yet again, bringing you guys some more rank matches for Splatoon 3. In today's video, we're hopping onto that rank ladder, trying to push up a higher rank, but this time showcasing a brand new mode, Tower Control. You guys already know the deal. If you do enjoy the Splatoon 3 content and want to see more on the Jeans channel, make sure you hit that like button. And if you're not subscribed to the channel, click that big red subscribe button to join the Jeans community. It really goes a long way. But the weapon we are starting out with today is one of my favorites from Splatoon 2. We got the Slasher. It is a bucket of paint, as you guys can see, and you could just toss a good amount, like a, an amazing amount of uh, ink all over the place. That's why I love this bucket. And it two shots people. So if you, if you can hit people twice, it kills them there and you can actually like throw it over walls it's awesome throw it up high and it's just a rapid fire pace like i just love the amount of ink you can spread alongside with the kill damage it just works really well our sub bomb is going to be this little uh grenade well the little spy grenade which is probably my favorite grenade i think it's the best grenade all around it's one of the better ones and then our special is going to be the triple ink strike which is amazing i really do like this for tower control it's really good at control it can push people off the tower and all that good stuff but this is not the only weapon we're going to be using i'll probably start off the first two battles using this weapon and then we'll slide over to another weapon but with that out the way let's hop into some tower control and some rank battles in splatoon 3. Loading into our first match for today's video, we are on the Museum Del Afino. Is that how you pronounce it? It's the Museum stage and it is tower control. So the object for this rank mode is to hop on a tower that is set in the middle and ride it closest to your opponent's base. So if you are the only team on the tower, it will ride it and it will push forward and then you got to protect it and all that good stuff. So this is actually one of the better rank modes in my opinion. I feel like this Rainmaker and uh, Splatoon's are the top three and Clan Butts is just on the side. But as you can see, they are pushing the tower and there is someone on the tower. So we got to kind of get them off the tower here but for now we're just gonna push back because that's not that far i'm not too worried about it this guy is going to send a special here too i am going to break it because i do not want it around here can i break that thing please there we go so he broke his special and we're chilling and actually i'm gonna hop on the tower can i get up on this tower let's do it so now we're chilling we're on a tower and i'm gonna start popping some ink strikes here pop some ink strikes just to kind of keep control of the tower really well and then we get rolling from there so look at that we push the checkpoint and we are going to take the lead right here and i'm gonna actually put a grenade up there Push these guys back and just keep pushing points for the towers. Look at us roll. Look at Gene's roll. Right off the rip. Doing good. We threw a nice little nade there. I am going to hop off here just to try to get my teammates here. But uh, I died. I died to the special. I had two grenades on me. Two specials. But it's all good. We pushed the tower to 53. And we get a lot of points for that. So I'm loving it. I'm loving it. So what I like to do when I'm on defense and when I get back is I like to charge up my special because having your special in this mode is really good at defending. It really is. Because like you guys will see, if they're on a tower... They're not on tower right now, but since he's going up there, I'm just going to throw some specials all around. And she's going to push them off it. So doing that, there we go. We get a kill, and it pushes them off the tower, which is amazing. But can we destroy that wave breaker? This is just chilling there. Got someone down there. I actually just hit him once. There you go. There's a nice little two shot. They came out, and they're getting on the tower. So, you know, I'm going to try to put a bomb right up on there. I'm going to toss. Nice little toss by me. And there is still someone near tower. So, you know, I'm going to toss bomb, and I'm going to push that. Can I push up here? Nope. I shouldn't have. I shouldn't have. I don't have like a close range gun where I can just melt somebody off rip. I should have kept my distance and kept throwing bombs up there and just wait for my teammates. But they are going to take lead here. They are going to take lead. I'm going to charge up my special a little bit and we're going to get pushing from there. They only took it by one. Actually, here they go. They're pushing it a little bit more now. I'm getting specialed on. And I'm going to die here, aren't I? How are you doing? No way. Okay, I'll take an assist. I almost had the double kill. Or I almost had that kill and then reversed on that other guy. But dang, yo, these guys are pushing it like crazy, right? They are on the board here. So we need a big push coming out here. I'm going to hook this nade here. I'm going to try to get rid of him. We got rid of him. And we need some big time defense here. I see you up there. Oh, I'm out of ink. Thank you, teammates, for uh, protecting me there. You know, I'm just charging this up. I'm going to charge this up. Are they, are they really on tower? I'm going to throw my special. I'm going to push them all back. I'm going to tell them to get on out of here. And now we're going to defend here. Okay, slow it down. We got to slow it down. I'm gonna throw this bomb, and of course, there's a little splat thing. I saw someone landing in there, and this, we're gonna have a tough time here. Actually, land us right on the tower. That's a nice throw by me. Hit that guy. I hit him again. There we go. Another kill. He throw us here, and one on top of us just to protect everybody. And I'm gonna hop on this tower. Oh, I didn't even see us, dude. I hit him again. There we go. There's a nice little kill. All right, now we got the tower. Now we got the tower. We gotta get pushed. We have two minutes left to get uh, closer than them. I'm gonna just start inking up everything. And there is a dude up here. I actually hit him once actually really good and let me put a bomb over top that wall just start inking all this actually i almost have my special i'm gonna toss one here i'm gonna toss one here i'm gonna toss one here and push them all back there's a nice little kill and i died by a special yeah i didn't even see that special because my special was going off but we did get some nice kills there i'm gonna hop over to my teammates right now they're picking up some kills 
Yeah, I'm still gonna hop over to him. Yep. Let's go. Let's drop a bomb right here. If they'll pop up here. And dude, that's the uh, what's called is so good in this map or this mode. What is it? The blasters? Because you can just shoot around the tower and it'll explode onto it. Let me actually hop over to my teammates here. We have a chance to take a lead here. We have a chance to take a lead here. Let's drop the bomb here. And we have this this guy dude again we took the lead which is awesome but the blasters are just so good so that was a beautiful push by us we kept hopping on the tower pushing up more and now we have a lead and now it's all about that defense it's all about that defense so you know what? i'm just gonna charge up my special i'm just gonna charge up my special and that's why i love the slasher on this map or in this mode i just love it so much because you can just ink up a bunch of turf you can get a lot of control and it's good for pushing up and the special and this uh bomb is really good for it because what i realized about uh tower control is grenades are really really strong in it they really are and they have a lot of pressure going here. So, you know what? I'm just going to go send my special. I'm just going to send one here, here, and here. Just push them all back and do that. Nice. We got a kill. Beautiful. We got a kill here. I'm just going to keep inking up this turf, keeping control on our side. And this guy is going to drop a wave breaker. So, I kind of want to get up on this high ground. And I kind of want to destroy it for the boys. Destroy this. There we go. Destroy that. And they are on the tower. I'm put a nade right up there. There we go. We got a kill. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. So again, just defense all day. They're gonna try to hop back on tower, and I didn't even see this dude. Need to back. We drop one here. Drop two on the tower. Let's see if we can get any kills. No kills, but we're defending really well. It's gonna go into overtime. So if we can get them off the tower, we will win this game. Come on, boys. There it is. Our boys hopped up on tower and match one. I felt like we played, we played decent there. They had a hard push in the uh, I would say like beginning, middle of the match. But we ended up having a hard push at the end to pick up that win. Which is awesome but how did i do i feel like i did pretty good i had the most ink turf i usually like to do that a lot i was the number one most popular target and i was the number one score booster i love to just ink up turf that is my thing that is my thing keeping control of the turf especially with this slasher let's see how many kills we had how many deaths we had how many specials we used i feel like we use a lot nine kills seven deaths seven specials i'm digging it i'm digging that second match coming at you guys we're back on the same map looking to go back to back and let's get rolling here we're using a slasher yet again i was hoping we could get the uh the second map but we could definitely get it in the third or fourth battle we'll definitely get it in the third or fourth battle but uh we're gonna roll out here i'm just gonna paint up some turf here get some positioning and i kind of fell down and i did not want to fall down so i'm gonna drop an eight here and i'm gonna try to get into better position here because i really hate this corner right here i'm gonna slide over here and keep painting it and i'm gonna roll out from here Got pushing up on me hopefully not you get up here I need my special. If I can get my special, nope, I get sniped by a bazooka. <laughs> I get sniped by the trizooka. All I wanted to do was get my uh, special, but uh, of course I fell off right off the rip, and that kind of did me dirty. Put me in a bad position. I had to change it from there, but not too bad. Our teammate is picking up my slack, and we're going to start rolling from here, because if I can push up and get this special, which I just did, and kind of roll from here, because I'm going to put this around the tower. I'm going to squeeze that one through here. I'm going to throw one up there, and we're just going to ride for extra points here. Let's do it. I'm going to charge up my special again. There's someone over here. There was a sniper, but I took him out. He sniped me. I threw something at him. I'll take it all day. It wasn't a sniper. It was a bow guy. But we got a little bit of a lead. Not too bad. I'm going to hop over here and charge up the special. You just drop a need here. Drop a need. Get all that fresh ink because you guys know the deal with that. Fresh ink will give you more points towards your special. It's really good. Let's keep painting. I might just throw some nades over there. Put a nade on tower. Nice toss. That was a beautiful toss. You know, let's do this. Let's drop one here. Now, of course, I die. But I get a double kill. I'll take that all day, dude. I've been trading off with people all this match. I'll die for a double kill. I'll take that trade all day. Drop that nade. Get some more ink. And keep charging that special, man. I just feel like charging a special can really, like, bring you to victory. I really feel that way. I always do best when I'm just charging up my special and kind of hanging back a little bit. Especially on defense. But, you know, I got another special ready to go. I'm going to toss one here. I'm going to toss one there. And do I get a kill? I do get a kill. Beautiful. So I'm going to wait for that bomb to explode. Hop up here and I'm gonna see if I can toss this guy. Got one. Beautiful. Got two. Nice. Let's go. We got a wipeout. Now we can push up on the tower. Let's go. Have that guy ride it. I'm just gonna get all this ink right here. Get all this ink and try to charge up another special. Actually, I must have one. I do have one. I'm gonna throw one here. Throw one here. And I'm gonna throw one here. Just keep the tower clean. Beautiful. Get an assist there. And we are rolling, yo. I'm rolling for the squad. Got someone up there. I kill him. I got him. I got him. Now I'm gonna take tower control. Let's go. Let's go. Go, crew. Oh, dude, I hit that dude once. We're down to 15. That is beautiful. 14, actually. What a push by us, yo. I picked up a few double kills. Got a bunch of specials. That's why the specials are so important. You guys see me controlling that whole tower with the specials. You know what? I can hop over right to my teammates here. And, of course, they took tower. They're going to kill me, but I'm going to throw a bomb right here. Just uh, drop that, and we are kind of doing pretty good. I can just dip this guy and try to get another bomb. I'm trying to get a bomb. 
trying to get a bomb and trying to ride it, but it's all good. I just, I just feel like if we play defense, we kind of have this one on lock. But our teammates keep pushing it. They keep pushing it, and I feel like nah, now now's the time where they get it. Yeah, they got the tower now. They got the tower. Awesome push by us. We're sitting in such a good spot. Again, I'm going to just charge up my special. These guys are giving me no reason not to just charge up the special. The more specials, the better. You guys know to deal with that. The more specials, the better. We got this thing coming at me. We got a special ready to go. I'm kind of waiting for them to push up. Can I hit him from here? We got to push this dude. Oh, dude, I should have sent my special. I should have spent my special. They got the ranged weapons. I got to kind of hang back, you know? And we're pushing the tower again. Do I hop over to the tower? No, I'm gonna I'm gonna hang back. I'm hanging back, dude. We got the lead. We're chilling pretty good. I got a decent amount of kills. I just think it's all it's all special time right now. I almost have another one. I just want to get it going and toss it over there. There we go. We got it. I'm gonna throw one here, one here, and one in the back. I can pick up a KO here. Do not. Oh, I have another one. I totally forgot I had another one. <laughs> I right, said so I got tower. I'm gonna put a bomb right on tower. See if I can snipe him with that. It's a good toss and E special on me. Toss that on there. I get him with that bomb. I'm gonna push up on this dude. Someone hit him once. There we go. I'll take the KO. And now I gotta hop off because if not, I'm gonna die. And I already died. But still, I'll take that defensive trade all day. If they're on the tower, you can just hop straight up on it and get straight after them. Yeah, but not bad, yo. We're doing pretty good. They are pushing us a little decent right now. I'm gonna hook this nade right now. I just hit that guy twice. There's a kill for us. And can we take tower? Yes, we take tower back, which is amazing. We take tower. They're back on it, though. We put a knee right up on it. Ah, uh, he got to dip back. Got a kill. Beautiful. And you know what? I'm going to send this here. Put one on the tower. I'm going to send another one up there. Okay, control. There's another kill. Let's go. Wipe out. And that should pretty much be GG's. Big time wipe out for us. Let's just charge the specials. Let's just charge the specials, boys. Oh, there's someone down here? I didn't even realize that. I saw a wipe out. And you know what? I'm going to make this hop here. Someone right here. Just hit him once. I don't know where he's at now. I think we killed him. He's right on the side of the tower. Get him. I kill him? Yep, got him. Last kill of the game. I love it. And I'll take the tower for victory. Beautiful, yo. Beautiful two matches with the slasher. I love it so much. I love this weapon. As you guys can see, I can fully charge my special multiple times. I think I had like seven or eight special charges there. Right? That's back to back. And I had most kills in the lobby. Let's go. Number one overall splatter. And we had the most turf inked. That's an amazing match from us. Really is a good match from us. How many kills I have? 15? 15, I feel like. I feel like it's 15, right? Or do we have more? Let's see. 14. So pretty pretty good. Seven specials, 14 kills, seven deaths. What a match from us. So guys, I ended up changing my weapon from the slasher to this end zap. End zap is actually a really good gun. It has decent range, decent damage, decent fire rate. It is good all around. I really do like this weapon, but it has a nice little suction bomb. But what I really like about this set right here is going to be it's special. I got the Tenthy Cooler right here, and this is really good for your team. So it drops cans of sodi right here, which you can actually pick up, and it gives you a speed boost, which is amazing. So if everyone on your team has a speed boost, it really rolls out well. But this gun was in Splatoon 2, and I absolutely love it. So I, I saw it in the shop. I was like, let me buy it. Let me use it in today's video, and we're going to try to get some wins with it. But hopping into our third match, can we get a different map? We do get the other map. Cool. So we get the other map. I don't even know what this is called. I totally forget. It's like a resort one. Might, he, might be a Mahi Mahi Resort? That what's called? Why does that why does that name sound familiar? But we're back on tower control. We're back on tower control. They got two snipers, a roar, and a arrow spray. So they can actually turf up a lot of ink. But this gun turfs up a lot of ink too, and I love it. I love this weapon so much. Just the range and everything about it is really good. And let's see if I can actually poke this dude from that side. I'm actually gonna hop over here. And our teammate got him. Cool. Oh my god, dude, we're thriving here. We're pushing up really well. I'm gonna just throw a high bomb here. If I can land it over there. And I'm gonna get up on this tower with the boys. I'm gonna get up on the tower with the boys. Look this bomb here. I see that guy. And let me get back up on the tower here. Because I do have my special and I can drop it right on tower. Oh my god, are we gonna do a quick sweep? We're we gonna do a quick sweep. Let me just defend here. Get that kill. How you doing? I get this kill. Got that kill. Double kill. I get triple. I'm pushing this dude. And that's game. That is game. That is game, yo. Let's go. Let's go. Dominating the third match. Complete sweep in a matter of how long was that? Like 30 seconds? We hopped on the tower, got the kills, all that good stuff. And I kind of knew that we were going to dominate once I saw the weapons. I was like, yo, they have two charge weapons. They don't really have anything to kind of ink up turf or anything. That's exactly what we did. I rolled in there for a double kill to kind of clean up the end. There it is, yo. Third match in the bag. We might have to do five matches for today's video, but that was a good one right there. Two kills, no deaths, one special use. Out of our team, though. How did our team do? Let's see it. 
Where are they at? Where's the squad at? Where's the squad at? How come I can't see how the, the team did? I'll stick with the team. Oh, there it is. Our dude had five, our sniper had five kills. Wow, yo, what a match. Let's hop into our fourth. I'd like to kill four in a row for today's video. Fourth and final match coming at you guys for today's video. And that last match might have been one of the quickest matches I've ever played in Splatoon 3. Legit hopped on the tower, dominated from there, and just rode it all the way to victory. But we're back on the uh, the museum map. I was kind of wishing we got the resort map again because, you know, we only played about 30 seconds on it. But, yo, it is what it is. I'm going to put a bomb up on the tower in case they want to hard push it. They do not, which is totally fine. So I'm just going to keep inking. Try to get ourselves a nice little cooler here. Nice little tempty cooler here. We're throwing bombs over there. We should be thriving here. And I can get my team this cooler right here. Shop this right here so they can actually hop up and get it if they want it and let's we'll keep putting some pressure on this tower here i'll throw a bomb they want to go right or left we do pick up assist and they have a crab tank they have a crab tank they have a crab tank up there which i want to probably just throw a bomb up there a good bomb by me and I actually got exploded i don't know how i don't know what to hit but let me keep pressure up there throw another bomb and just keep turfing ink keep on turfing this ink i don't want to commit too much and have them get a good push off of that so i kind of just want to hang back and wait for our chance Give my team another tenthy cooler. If they want it. They can thrive out with it. And I'm going to just put some more bombs up here. And of course, I'm getting special. It's all good. It's all good. I can dodge it. I can dodge it all day. And I can pick up that kill. Big time kill. And now we might want to push up here. Let's go. Yeah, we got the numbers. We got numbers. We have numbers. So we are going to push up. I'm just going to put a bomb right here. I see that guy with the crab tank. I'm going to hop off to the side here. And I might die. E. Nope, I'm the best. I'm the best. How am I going to get out of this situation? You put a nade up this way. I'm going to wait for a sneak attack here. I'm going to have to, right? Where are these guys at? Pick up a kill this way. I'm for the flank on this guy. Got to get him. Can I get you? Get him. Cool. And can I turn on you? Okay, I almost did. I'll take a double kill all day. I'll take a double kill. So I was in a sticky situation there. I was in the crab tank, but I actually made the most of it, which was really good. But I can charge up my special real quick. Give my team a cooler. We have a really close match right now, and we just took a tower. So I'm going to try to push up with them and get the cooler rolling. Got this guy right here. I get him. I'll take a trade. I'll take a trade. I should have had the kill before he even got a chance, but I ended up missing missing a shot. I hit him with like the first two, and then I kind of just, my aim went all over the place. We can actually thrive out from here. I'm not going to land on tower because they're about to take it back. And we'll go. No, I want my cooler. I want my cooler for a squad. I gotta give them all speed boost, and I'm gonna actually leave this right here. And we're gonna go from there. And I'll put a bomb on tower. If I got speed boost, oh, they're coming after me hard. I see them all right here. I tried to defend them. Let me actually put a bomb. Tried to. Oh, I missed my bomb. I want to try to defend this guy pretty good for us. Come here. Wait, back on my teammate. I got you, buddy. Oh, no, he died. He died. Let me, let me grab tower real quick. Uh, of course, he knew I was coming up. But, dude, that crab tank, man. That thing rips. <laughs> that thing low-key rips. They do take the lead here. I don't think we're sitting in a bad spot because 58, 55, around 40 isn't a hard range kind of push. Got this guy. I'll take the kill on you. And they're going to be back on tower, so I'm going to just put a nade up there. And you know what? I'm going to grab right here. I'm going to go up right here. And he's, this dude's thinking the same thing as me. Dude's thinking the same thing as me. Can I get up here? Why is it, like, acting all weird? Don't get the kill. And they got a crab tank again. So these guys are pushing up with some authority right now. With some authority. We are 3-0 for today's video. So if we lose this battle, I still feel like we did really good. But we can definitely win this battle. Oh, my God. Dude, they got specials galore. Put a nade up on the tower. Put a nade right up on that tower. And you know what? Why aren't we hopping up here, boys? There we go. Get rid of him. Let's get pushing. I see a dude right there. You know what? Can I get him? I'll take an assist. What is that sound? Oh, he's, this guy has a bow and arrow on us. We drop a tentacle here. We put a nade right up there, too. And, of course, I missed my need. I missed my need. Oh, but I pick up a kill on the backswing. And these guys have a nice killer wall placement. And I'm dipping out of here. Okay. So there's this guy. And the Octobrush gets me. Okay, not too bad. These guys got to pick up the kill on that guy. We need a big push. We need a big push right here, right now. Right here, right now. It's big push time. It's big push time. So I'm going to throw a nade over on that side. And you know what? I'm going to be the flank guy. I'm going to be a flank guy. Because we should be able to get tower here. And I can take out this bow guy. And someone else is laying here, which is pretty good. We can just fire away from on him. Charge up a special. Can we get on the tower, please? I'm actually dro just drop this right here. I drop this right here. Missing my shots. 
And of course he has a crab tank. I'm dead. No, I'm not. I'm too good. Let me get on tower. Why couldn't my boys get on tower here? Why couldn't my boys get on tower there? That could have been a good little tower for us. I think I'm alone. I might be alone here. I am alone here. Man, dude, I was pushing up. I had the flank. I had everything rolling for the squad. And nobody was hopping on that tower. That's fine, yo. That is going to be GG. So we go 3-1 and one for today's video. Let's see how we did on our solo stats, on our personal stats. Let's see. So we don't get knocked out, though. But I think that was a solid match all around. We just didn't have any offensive pressure. Every time we tried to get something rolling, they countered us. Nobody was up as a team. All that good stuff. Because that's how Splatoon is. Splatoon is probably one of the biggest like team games. So if you're not rolling with your squad, you're going to lose. You're definitely going to lose. But let's see how we did. Did I have most kills for team? I could have, but I... Definitely a chance that I didn't did have most kills for team 14 and 6 with five specials. Not too bad. Not too bad. Most kills for a squad. Let's see how everybody else did in the lobby. Let's see how our losing team did. Let's see. I had 14 kills. I didn't have most kills in the lobby. Somebody had one more kill than me on the other team. It was that Octobrush guy. But uh, our team had 10, 5, and 3. Ooh, 5 and 3. Really, really brought us down. But hey, 3 and 1 for today's video. Not too bad. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. We fully showcased the rank mode tower control, and we got to show off the slosher and the end zap weapon. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy today's video. The rank battles are definitely fun for me to record. And if you guys want me to record more rank battles or have any video suggestions for Splatoon 3, let me know in the comment section down below. But guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know my videos go live. Seriously, you guys rock out. Make sure you spend some positivity today. I'll catch you on the next one. Peace out, everybody.